Andy Katz here for NCAA.com with a look at some of the top storylines in women's basketball for the 2019-20 season. Let's start with the return of the rivalry. First time since 2007, UConn's going to take on Tennessee. Tennessee has a new head coach, Kelly Harper. Former Vol, she won three national championships playing for the late great Pat Summit. Former head coach at Missouri State. Great to see UConn taking on Tennessee. My second storyline, Notre Dame, two years removed after winning the national championship. The Irish and Muffet McGraw have to replace five starters. And in that national championship game last season, they lost to Baylor. Baylor returns with a chance to win another national championship. Lauren Cox, she's healthy. And so the Bears have a chance to win back-to-back -back national championships. But will they? Well, let's take a look. Let's go out west. Stanford, Tara Vanderveer, she's been in this position before. She's got a top recruiting class. I've got the Cardinal in the Final Four. Texas A&M, they got five starters back. The Aggies in the Final Four. UConn, I don't want to hear it rebuilding. I just can't not put Gino Oriema and the Huskies in the Final Four. Oregon is my fourth team in the Final Four, but they may be the best team. Who's going to win the Women's National Championship? I'm going to keep it in Eugene. The Oregon Ducks. Why are they going to win the National Championship? Well because they're going to have the National Player of the Year. Her name, Sabrina Ionescu. She can do a little bit of everything for Oregon. She can stat stuff. She's going to be an exceptional player in the WNBA. Before she gets there, she's going to win a national championship for the Oregon Ducks out of Eugene.